welcome back to my channel. Today we're going to be looking at energy from fuel calculations. I have a more detailed video looking at how to carry these out. This video is intended as a practice video. First, let's look at the equation. We use the equation E equals Cm delta T, where E is energy in kilojoules, C is the specific heat capacity of water, which is given the value 4.18 kilojoules per kilogram per degree C. You can find this in your data book. M is the mass of water in kilograms and delta T is the change in temperature in degrees C. You can calculate this by taking the end temperature minus the start temperature. As well as being able to calculate energy, you need to be able to use the equation to calculate mass and change in temperature. To calculate mass, you take energy divided by the specific heat capacity multiplied by the change in temperature. To be able to calculate the change in temperature, you would take energy divided by specific heat capacity multiplied by the mass of water. This is useful if you're asked for the end temperature. Let's look at one example. Here you're asked to calculate the energy when 0.45 grams of ethanol burns to heat 100 mls of water from 25 degrees to 45 degrees. The mass of ethanol is given in the question as a red herring. The mass that you need to use is the volume of water divided by a thousand to get a mass in kilograms. The change in temperature is the end temperature minus the start temperature, which gives you 20 degrees as your delta T. You then need to write out the equation E equals Cn delta T and insert the values 4.18 multiplied by 0.1 multiplied by 20. This gives an energy of 8.36 kilojoules. Pause the video now and try these examples. Pause the video now and try these examples. You will need to rearrange the equation for mass.
video now and try these examples. You will need to rearrange the equation for delta t. You will then need to use this to calculate perhaps the end temperature or the start temperature. Thank you for watching my video, I hope that you found it helpful. Please remember to subscribe and ring the bell to be notified of new videos. You can also follow me on Twitter at Miss Adams Chem and Instagram Miss Adams Chemistry for updates throughout the year and flashcards. Bye for now!